Hey community, joining you here by video in our weekly email. And there's three things that uh, I wanted to share with you. Number one is all about Good Friday and Easter Sunday. Uh, Good Friday, three services, one at 4 p.m., 5.30, 7 p.m. We're going to have childcare through kindergarten, but all the other kids are going to be joining us in the celebration space. So look forward to seeing you then. And then on Easter Sunday, we are making room for as many as 2,000 additional people. And we're doing that by adding two Sunday morning services. So we're going to have four total services on Easter Sunday, one at 8 a.m., then 9.30, 11.15, and then 1 p.m. And I want to encourage you, if, if, it, allow, if, if it works in your schedule, uh, perhaps the most missional thing that you can do, uh, besides inviting friends or family to join you, would be to celebrate with us at 8 a.m. or 1 p.m. so that we create space for the many hundreds of first-time attenders. So keep that in mind. We'd love to see that happen. Uh, here's the second thing. Uh, this Saturday is Time Change Sunday. Only this is the Time Change Sunday that we don't really look forward to because we have to spring forward. We have to lose an hour of sleep. But it is going to be so worth it because on Sunday morning, we're going to continue in our series called The Power of One. And this Sunday in particular, I'm going to be talking about the, the significance, the importance of just one decision, the difference that one decision can make in our lives and the things that God can do when we make that decision. We're going to continue talking about Abraham and Sarah. And on one occasion, God says to Abraham, now I know that you fear me. Do you know what Abraham did in order for God to say that and then go on to bless him in a significant way? We're going to talk about that. and We're also going to talk about what that would look like in our lives as well. So I hope to see you this Sunday at 930 or 1115. Take care.